Und dann sind wir wieder bei Life is Strange. Weiter geht's. My brain is so fried from all this. I need a mental enema. Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens. And it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at Look night. Look at the bead poet here. <laughs> I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. Perfect. <gasps> Das ist immer gut. Oh, stupid light. No go. Shit. Gut. Now that's the right cable. Yes, I did it. Whoa. You okay? You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Damn. That was close. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers <laughs> might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. Das ist echt putzig. Ja, es geht doch nichts über gute Freunde. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. 
Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Snow equals a ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five years ago, asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's <laughs> party with your power, Rockstar. Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. Das sieht genauso aus wie derselbe Gruß, den wir im RT bei uns machen. Für die, die es nicht wissen, RT bedeutet Rettungsdruck. Das ist da, wo ich arbeite. Mal so nebenbei. Wenn man jetzt noch wüsste, was das ist, ne? Vielleicht erkläre ich es beim nächsten Mal. Enter the Vortex Club. This October. Nein, danke. Muss ich nicht haben. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. Yup, come on. Hello. Sir? Ah, hello, Max. Would, would you like to tell me what you wouldn't yesterday? No, I mean, I don't have anything to tell you. More secrets. Now, excuse me, I have a meeting to attend. Mas good. Justin, Justin always looks dumb. If I was normal, I'd be super excited about going to a major shindig. End of the world party. Man, das Zeug hängt überall. It's the invasion of the Vortex Club. Zachary always looks like he's ready to throw a football. Hello, Zach. Sup, Max? It's weird to not see you without your camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sext in Victoria. It's over. Just another Blackwell mini drama. You mean stupid shit. Man, I just don't get Victoria. What does she want? Probably for all of us to talk about her. Like now. Then let's not. You're pretty smart, Max. See you at the game Friday. See ya. Da läuft jemand. Vollkommen teilnahmslos. Wow. Hey! Courtney will do anything for Victoria. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. I'm not anti-soiree. You seem anti-fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. Really? Oh, like you care. I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. As you can see, I would need your advice on what to wear. Thanks, Max. I didn't think you noticed high fashion. Tell you what, I'll put you down on the guest list, and before the party, I can give you some tips. Cool. Thanks, Courtney. I'll send you the party info later. Back to the list. Nicht, dass es mich interessieren würde, aber von mir aus. If I was normal, I'd be super excited about going to a major shin. I should go and see what I can learn.
Does anybody believe this shit? Oh, man. Hi, Trevor. Trevor surveys his domain. Ah, uh, David Dickhead. Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? Yeah, we, uh, we stehen mal dazu. Yes, it was. You know that marijuana is almost legal in Oregon. I can get it at Blackwell. Are you gonna bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. Hmm. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you, but it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Mm, not good. Sci-fi lab. I'm now shorting as pretty. See you soon. Okay. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist and Luke is always using the phone as a shield to avoid people. Juliet is laying the smack down on Zachary. I really hope this jackass will use protection next time. Ah, yeah, you know. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Ich weiß nicht, ich weiß weder was sodium noch potassium ist, von daher. I have a vision. Go diem. Go diem? That's the worst pun I've ever heard. Yet Max has spoken. Sodium it is. Damn, zip, nothing, nada. Big brain, think. Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. This Making your daily hard. rounds? I'm helping Warren with his latest experiment. Oh, I guess he needed a neophyte assistant so he wouldn't be threatened. But you came to his rescue anyway. Apparently, it's my nature. <laughs> Yet, Warren ignores the experts right in front of him. Not that he would ask me for help anyway. Huh. Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. Make... I need to know if you can help me with a potassium experiment. No can do, Max. I'm all about robotics, not chemistry. Give me a drone over a beaker. How is your drone? Miss Grant busted me flying it over the parking lot. She's all jacked up about surveillance bullshit. Like I was spying on Warren's new car. You already planted a GPS on him? I borrowed the one he has on you. I'm helping Warren. Oh. Not me. Warren doesn't need.